All right, Halos, how's everyone doing? We're trying out Mol uh, Smolder rather today. I just wanted to try him out um, first of all. So hopefully this goes well. I have not tried him yet at all, um, so this is gonna be my first attempt, or first uh, first look, I guess. So let's check him out. Let's look at his uh, his stuff real fast. Let me up my FPS a little bit. All right, that should be better. All right, so his joke. Let's do this one. Oh, look at me. I'm people. <laughs> I'm people. Well, my mom's the biggest, baddest dragon around, Maybe and she's gonna burn you. There's the taunt. It's like a permanent, like it just continues to go. I mean, it's looped. Just a laugh. Looks like he just keeps laying around on the ground, and then the dance. No audio for it, but that's fine. And uh, let's check out the abilities. Um, so his dragon practice, which is a permanently stacking thing, I think. Hitting champions with abil abilities and killing enemies with super scorcher breath, which is Q. Grant smolder a stack. How long is his range, by the way? 550. A stack of um, dragon practice. Okay. Probably should have gone to practice tools so I could see this. But I wanted to get first one of the day at the same time. So we're doing it in a bot game. Um, Let's go ahead and do that anyways. Uh, so that's... Stacks increase the damage of smaller basic abilities by a bunch of numbers. Okay. Um, I think Q is usually what you want us to max, and then we'll probably go... I don't know what next, honestly. Is this a straight ability, or is it, like, targeted, or what? Oh, okay, yeah, it's targeted. All right, good to know. And it's 100% of my auto damage, or base AD rather it looks like. Oh, whoops, I messed that one up. Yeah, it does a little bit more damage now, so that's good. Let's get that. Let's try to get a stack with the, um, see how many stacks the cannon minion gives us. Looks like just one, okay. Good to know. Oh, Alexa's thinking I'm talking to her. Forgive me, forgive me. All right, and then let us see. Okay, so it scales with the passive stacks a certain amount, not as not a one to one, and it also scales with scales with crit on the Q and the E. It looks like it's good to know. Um, okay, that just does straight up damage. It also applies my lethal tempo, so it seems to. Act as an auto attack, yet yeah, and applies on hit, hit effects. All right, what's the W? So an adorable flaming sneeze. Okay. Okay, interesting. That's his E. He just like jumps in the air, kind of. It looks like. All right, I don't know if I got a stack for uh, for killing him there, but let's kill this guy with a Q. I think it's just kills that you get with the Q it gives you stacks, not like every every attack gives you it or anything. Might be wrong about that though. Marino says people think there's no it only costs 29 mana on level 1, so that's that's nice. It's kind of a weird number though. And it doesn't really go up. Cooldown goes down, the base damage goes up. Okay, interesting. And then the W... Might have to go more in depth than this, like a practice tool at some other point, but I just kind of wanted to try him out first, so we won't go super deep dive, I guess, on it right now, but yeah. I keep thinking it's like a Kog'Ma Q, so I'm like aiming behind him, but you have to actually target him. And this, apparently you can go over to walls or something, interestingly enough. Oh wow, that does a lot of damage, actually. Okay. I now have 25 stacks of Q. Let's get him before he recalls. There we go. So now it does an AOE blast on my Q. That's pretty cool. Well, it seems like W is pretty good for wave clear, actually. How does E do on wave clear? Not very much. Not very well, honestly. Okay, let's go ahead and recall. Try to get our first item, I think. Uh, we don't have quite enough yet, but we'll be 
would be pretty close. Oh, okay, never mind. Let's take out this guy. Since he's gonna come see us for a second. We can get an, a little bit extra gold and we should be able to get our first item. Since he came to say hi. Let's get a stack off of him though. Alright. Should we use our ult as well? Let's use our ult real fast. This heals her son if she hits him. Okay. Interesting. I actually didn't do as much damage as I was kind of hoping. Alright. Well, that's some damage, I guess. But yeah, it wasn't quite as much as I was hoping, to be honest. Alright, we keep, we're keep we staying longer than we need to, but... <laughs> well. It'll be alright. Let's dive him. There we go, nice. <laughs> Get our demolish proc off and then we can recall. How about that? This guy might chase us though. This does more damage. So does this though. Alright, it does a decent amount to champions it seems. Let's try to last hit him with the Q if we can. There we go. Don't know if the Alistar saw us, but anyways. Uh, okay. So, E. He take, gains 100% movement speed and ignore terrain for 1.25 seconds. Um, oh, so if you have more crit, it actually attacks more times. Billy prioritize champions. Gains expanded vision. Okay. Um, let's do... Uh, I feel like a lot of things would be good, but let's go Kraken. Pretty typical. And let's get some Berserker Greaves for extra attack speed. I am running Lethal Tempo, by the way, if you didn't notice. Um... So that'll also help me a lot with uh, having enough attack speed and stuff, so that's cool. Yeah, I mean, it's a lot of damage with um, different things. AoE's pretty nice as well. Completely missed that cannon, don't worry about it. <laughs> um, but yeah, okay. So wait, did my W mark them? Hitting champions cause an causes an explosion. Oops. Um, what does I say? Dealing... Hold on, let me clear this wave real fast. Keep maxing Q if we can. Okay, so yeah, it does like a little explosion or something. Okay, does a pretty good amount of damage. This doesn't work on that, does it? No, it doesn't work on turrets, but that's fine. Wasn't expecting it to, honestly. There we go. So is it just abilities? No, this is hitting champions. Okay. It looks like just abilities caused the explosion, dealing a little bit extra damage, basically. So it lets about adorable flaming, flaming sneeze slows enemies by 35% for 1.5 seconds. Someone can gain one dragon practice stack per champion hit. Does a lot more damage to minions and monsters though. Okay, interesting. Okay. I keep using the Kog'Maw Q in my brain. It's kind of funny. Yes, yeah, so this is really good for wave clear basically. This champion looks pretty fun. He doesn't seem super like OP or anything I wouldn't say. Of course, it's hard to say for sure, but yeah, it doesn't seem like he's super OP or anything. How long is my W? Oh, it's really long, actually. Okay. Well, this is pretty fun so far. This champ seems pretty alright. I feel like he might need some buffs, though. We'll have to see, I guess. There we go. Is my Q longer range than my auto? It is not actually. Okay. Okay, I don't think this applies on hits, does it? I'm not sure. It didn't look like it was stacking my uh, 
Let me double check though. It doesn't look like it was stacking my. Um, what's it called? Not lethal tempo, but my uh, Kraken Slayer. Let me check though. Yeah, it is not proccing my uh, my Kraken Slayer, and I don't believe it's actually proccing my um, lethal tempo either. So this is not counting as auto attacks. It looks like. So it's actually pretty weak, from what I can tell. Maybe if you max it, it's better, but right now it looks a little weak to me. I mean, you do get quite a few attacks pretty quick, I guess, but yeah, it looks looks relatively weak to me. All right, good to know, good to know. How long till our next demolish proc? This is zero seconds. Okay, there we go. Must have just came off a cooldown. Try to get all three of these. Yeah, there we go. Oh, we got the next level off of it, actually. Nice. Alright, is this magic damage, by the way? It is magic damage, okay. I was going to say, it looked like it didn't deal that much damage overall. Uh, not really. <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and recall and then we'll uh, we'll TP back. But yeah, it seems like um, W's way better. We'll see though. Cooldown does get pretty low with E. I guess it's a, it's a wall hop mostly, so... Not really meant for damage, I suppose, you could argue. Uh, let's get some more um, crit chance, I think. Let's do... You know, Navori would probably be really good, actually. You won't be able to get Infinity Edge, though. That's the only thing. But everything scales with crit, uh, crit chance, not... Okay. Yeah, not really with... Uh, not really with um, crit damage or anything. So it, I don't think crit damage is like super necessary or anything. Let's try to get as much crit as we can though, real fast. Just so we can kind of see. Um, does this get more actually? No, it's the exact same. That's fine though. I think uh, Runeans is probably going to be pretty good at him, so let's get that. And then let's TP out. Looks like they cleared all my minions in the time that I was looking in the shop. So that's kind of funny. Yeah, it's, seems pretty nice. Once you get a couple items. <laughs> and a lot of crit. Uh, yeah, so Q definitely does quite a bit of damage. Damage increased by 30% of crit strike chance. Okay. Autos actually seem relatively low, slow, I would say. Get 600 attack range if you have um, what's what you call it? Uh, lethal tempo fully stacked. I mean, all right, it's doing pretty decent damage now. Now that you have uh, some more AD stacked, I guess. The W, I mean. Ooh, wow, I got chunked pretty hard there. Not getting a lot of life still since I sold my uh, my Dorans. There we go. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna get wrecked. Oh, nice. He got stuck on the wall. That's good. There we go. <laughs> there we go. This guy has uh, Grievous Wounds. Little Bramble Vest. Hey, yo, Pinta. Go. Yeah, W seems pretty nice, actually. We're all. Oh gosh. My champion auto path a little weird there. 
Wait, what's that? What's that execute thing I just saw? What's that execute thing I have? What the heck? I don't know. I have a lot of drag stacks. Oh, wait, hold on. Here we go. Here it is. 7%, drop below 7% total health while burning are killed instantly. Burns the target dealing... Wow, okay, at 225 stacks, that's a lot. Okay, wow, that's like super OP once you get to there. Okay. And you get stacks for just uh, hitting with a Q, right? Hitting shifters with abilities and killing enemies with Q. Grants a smolder a stack of dragon practice. So just hitting enemies with uh, abilities. So basically, Ray Vagar kind of stacks increase the damage of the abilities as well. Executed. Okay, wow. Interesting. Alright, let's go ahead and buy some more items. Uh, might as well do collector too, right? Although I guess it wouldn't really matter. Yeah, I guess it wouldn't really matter, actually. Um, let's do like this, and then last item. Honestly, it doesn't matter, but let's do Essence Reaver, because um, Q counts as an ability and an on-hit, so pretty good. Okay, let's not get the AFK warning, though. We also have, uh, looks like our maybe our helmet's a little bit lit brighter now. I'm not sure, though. Don't quote me on that. Yeah, that's crazy. Champion's kind of busted, actually. I mean, obviously, you have to get to that point, but, and it's not super easy or anything, but... Yeah, it seems nice. So, yeah, he's just, like, permanently burning now, basically. Okay. Wow. There we go, nice. Yeah, it's just like infinite damage too, almost. Yeah, actually quite literally. Yeah, that's crazy actually. <laughs> yeah, my E does a lot more damage because of my stacks and stuff as well. Okay, well cool. Well, thank you guys for joining me in my little exploration, exploration rather, of uh, feuding, viewing Smolder. I do appreciate it, and I will catch you in another one. Peace.